welcome to SQL reporting service and this is video number 48 and in this video we're going to discuss about the interactive sorting workout in the last video I said like you know the interactive sorting is not possible which is 100% fully right but you know sometimes clients are crazy they want something so they want something so here's one of the way I know okay so by default if we look at the groups and if we look at the sorting we all know they are grouped by default same goes with the category and same goes with the products so now there is uh, you know above this there is one more box okay right click on that click on the text box properties click on the interactive sorting okay click on uh, the normal one the detail rows and groups one second and this is what category and the sorted order should be category and click OK and let's save this and let's preview so as you can see now I'm very much capable of sorting I mean the interactive sorting what I'm doing is here so which is working pretty good for me at this stage but the problem comes when you go inside from the outside it is working because I have given it a sort and if I open the beverages beverages are still beverages without an issue if I open it so like it's not like you know the data is mismatched or something went wrong it is all good now the problem is I need to apply sorting on the products okay so let me get to the design first and let's let this guy open first save and preview okay much better okay I can see a lot of things now so now I wish to apply the same on the product so I'll quickly go to design I'll choose this box right click text box properties visibility I'm sorry this guy choose this groups and I'm gonna choose the product name so they know I'm sorting by product let's hit save and let's do the preview and we are looking at something right so let me open the beverages word it starts with C so I'm gonna sort I'm gonna look at it it looks the same I'll do the sort again okay and now it has changed now if I do the reverse it will be sorted again the problem over here is this window of the category is collapsing in and collapsing out so it becomes very difficult if you look at this section this is a sorted one if I go like this open again so you see this guy ends up in here so basically the sorting is working but not the way we want so what can we do is we can go like this group properties go to visibility not this guy I don't think this is the guy I'm sorry yes product name on which I configured group properties visibility I'm gonna say show I'm gonna take this guy out and I'm gonna do the save and I'm gonna do the preview so everything is open like now there's no problem if I go beverages so they are sorted this way if I go like this they are sorted again but now the power comes when I do the sorting in here you look at the beverages only and there's a section below that as well so what you're seeing over here is the things got changed and the change was done based on the group so if you look at one more time this guy is at top this guy getting end up and this teal eye goes up so it's kind of working the best example would be one second let me get more space open this up and scroll down the condiments all right the veggie spread is on the top and anise syrup as the bottom now let me sort and you remember these two guys so this guy goes up and the veggie spread goes down so the sorting is done you know based on the categories so this is awesome but it depends on the client like how does he want so technically speaking it is not working as 100% as expected but this is one of the workarounds if the client needs alright so I hope uh, this gives you an idea like how you can do the workaround way of interactive sorting 
and uh, I hope this video helps you and thank you for watching this video and if this video helps you in some way then please subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends thank you for watching good night and take care